So I'm working on the weights and I found the best way to do them is to put them on my drill bit to insert them into the collet and that's so I don't lose them because I've dropped them quite a few times. And then I just use my dials to turn them to the exact height. Then I can mount them to a brass arbor and really fine tune the, the thickness to make sure they're all identical, but this is a good jumping off point. I have one weight trimmed to height, two untouched, and one half finished. I've got one weight turned down to the right thickness and I've got it trimmed to 0.55. These weights are exceptionally small. After lapping them all with some micron paper and then some polish, I made this tapered steel rod to hold them while I chamfer the back edge, clean up the faces a little. So I've got these weights cleaned up a little bit and I'm going to put them in the ultrasonic and then that's it for now. I'm waiting on some little lapping paper to come in so I can polish these up and ensure that they're all uh, within a thousandth of a gram or something like that. So what I've got right here is a scale from Amazon. I wanted a scale that went to four digits. Those started around seven to eight hundred dollars. So I've got the scale and it's okay. I notice I kind of have to calibrate it between each and every way. So I'm gonna hold that. I'm gonna put on the 20 gram weight. It's gonna flash forward. I'm gonna put on the 40 gram weight. I'm gonna say pass. I'm gonna grab my weights here and it is weighing 0 0.012 grams. I'm gonna set that one aside. I'm gonna check my calibration again, and it's off by a little bit. So I'm going to recalibrate it. And I mean, this is not an expensive scale. This is like $20. I just couldn't find a high quality scale at a price that I was willing to pay right now. 0 0.014 for a scale. So accurate. Let's grab my next weight. Zero one two and check again with this weight still accurate. Point zero one two. Most of them are point zero one two. Which one was not? Zero one four. You are the suspect. Let me set that aside. This one should weigh in at point zero one two. Those three are fine. This one I'm going to start by just inspecting with my loop. Once I get my lapping paper in, that's when I will go through and really fine tune the weight, make sure that they're all 0.12, they'll probably be 0.1 when I'm done uh, lapping them. But that's it for this week. I can't really do anything else. I might try and turn some of the posts. For now, 